Hi everyone, today I'm here to give you a quick look at the new Droid Ultra by Motorola. The Droid Ultra is exclusive to Verizon Wireless and their 4G LTE wireless network. The Droid Ultra by Motorola is sleek and stylish with a large 5-inch Super AMOLED high definition display with screen resolution of 720 by 1280 giving it a pixel density of 294 pixels per inch. The large 720p high definition display is perfect for streaming or watching video without straining your eyes on a small screen. At the heart of the Droid Ultra is a combination of processor cores Motorola is calling the Motorola X8 Mobile Computing System. Motorola has decided to divide the cores so that they are dedicated for certain tasks. Four cores are dedicated to graphics processing to ensure everything runs and looks smooth on the Droid Ultra. Two of the remaining cores are devoted to application processing to make multitasking between apps seamless. The final two cores in the Motorola X mobile computing system are low power cores that allow the Droid Ultra to listen for and respond to your voice commands that start with OK Google Now. By speaking the phrase OK Google Now, you will awaken the Droid Ultra and be able to make phone calls, get traffic information, check on sports scores, or even send a text message. The Droid Ultra and the X8 mobile computing system can do all of this without draining your battery. Even though the Droid Ultra is razor thin, Motorola was able to squeeze in a 2130 mAh battery that Motorola is saying will last 28 hours of straight mixed use. On the outside of the Droid Ultra, you'll find meticulous attention to detail and an excellent choice of build materials. The combination of the edge-to-edge -edge Corning Gorilla Glass 3 covering the almost entire front of the phone paired with the woven Kevlar back cover that wraps around the corners of the Droid Ultra gives it an expensive look and feel. While everything I've already talked about would make the Droid Ultra worthy of being called a high-end flagship smartphone, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention the fact that the Droid Ultra is thinner than the iPhone 5S, even while packing all of the great hardware we've already spoken of. Last but certainly not least, I want to mention the 10 megapixel primary camera paired with an LED flash and the front-facing camera that's 2 megapixels. The quick capture camera feature on the Droid Ultra will let you go from pocket to picture faster than you can say cheese. I've enjoyed my time with the Droid Ultra and it's definitely a smartphone that I would want to use as my daily driver. That wraps up our quick look at the Droid Ultra by Motorola. Thanks for watching.